folks. This has been a while since we've done the last video. I've actually done a couple of videos. I've actually lost a couple of videos as well. But anyway, I'm doing this one. This is the third time I've done this one now. Hopefully you'll get to see this one. Well, this one's just about this um, torch or flashlight, as some people call it. Um, I want to do a review on it. Well, not really a review. I just want to show you it, basically. Um, it's a decent torch, and it's one that's made for vehicles, really. So I thought, well, whilst I'm parked up, oh, convertible Ferrari just pulled up. Lovely. It's dirty. It needs a wash. I don't know if you can see that over there. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, um, I nearly got run over by a Lamborghini today, which is a different story. Anyway, back to this torch. Um, I got it from Amazon. I think it was 16 or something like that. I can't remember now. Um, but I'll put a link in it. Uh, to where I bought it from in the description below and I wanted to show you why I think it's a good torch because first of all you've got this little lip here which is a seatbelt cutter so you get your seatbelt in there which is great for an emergency and also if you can't get out the window for whatever reason that rubber protector comes off and then you've got a window shatterer so uh, yeah I wouldn't like hitting on the head with that now I can't say it could double up as a, as a self defence weapon because that would probably be illegal but you know just saying anyway <coughs> it's an LED torch just a single LED I think it's got about five or six modes you've got on and then you've got like a, a middle brightness and then you've got a high brightness I think you've got a strobe as well but it is so bright, it's really, really good. Um, it doesn't take batteries. I'll show you what it takes, does in a minute. But yeah, it's just uh, it's like a digital. That, that's the lowest setting there. And as you can see in the sunlight, it's, you know, it's, it's spot on. Uh, number two. You probably didn't notice that difference in the sunlight. When the, oh, Ferrari's starting up. Uh, in the dark, you definitely will. And that's uh, brightness number three. I don't know if you can see that up there. Oh, one, two, three. And if you hold it down again, oh no. If you double tap it, you've got a strobe. Yay! Which is good for attaching, attracting attention. So that's great, yeah. It's just another torch, I bet you're thinking. But um, let me see if I can do this one handed. Yeah, I can't. I should have the, I should have the tripod for this, really, but. That's in the locker, and um, I'm not, so just bear with me one second. Great review. Great review this, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. I did it a little bit too tight. So, what we have here is a USB charger. And there you go, it's fully charged. So that tells you how, how uh, charged the battery is, the four lights. You, you actually charge the battery with this little mini USB here. But the best part about this is, let me just grab my phone one second. Just to prove to you, there's an iPhone 6 Plus, and there's the wire for it. So I'm just going to plug it in. It's pretty. Oh. Prove it does actually charge it. So once you plug something in, you just press the button. There you go. Charging my phone, and then it just shows you the, uh, the status there when you every time you press it. But uh, yeah, it's rather cool. It's always good as a backup, and you can charge other things with it. So if you charge an iPhone six. Plus, or whatever that phone is, it'll charge most things. Um, so I would recommend having one of these. I'm going to get another one actually. I want one for an ear that stays in here, and I'm going to get another one for the car because that will be always handy to have. I've actually charged this once, and I've used it quite a lot as a torch. 
I've not used it as a as a phone charge yet because I've not needed to in here. But um, I've used it quite a lot as a torch, doing the daily checks in the mornings or whenever it's dark or whatever. Um, so yeah, good bit of kit and for I think it was sixteen quid or something like that. You can't really go wrong for it. Uh, don't ask me to pronounce that. So 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 so, so a uh, it's a flashlight. Yeah. So um, if you're interested, links below. Go and get yourself one. If not, don't. I don't know. I did manage to recover one of the videos, which is um, from a couple of weeks ago. So I will get that edited and get that uploaded after this. After you see this video, obviously. Um, I haven't got my laptop charger with me today, so I can't really edit it on battery. Well, I can edit it on a battery power. But it means I have no power left really to watch a film or something later when I want to go to sleep. Um, so I'll edit it tomorrow when I get home. Uh, it's Thursday, Thursday now. Um, I'll probably upload this video tomorrow when I get home. Edit that one when I get home, and then that one probably should be out for the weekend. Depends how busy I'm on the weekend. Um, I'll try and find some time. If not, it's probably going to be Monday. But yeah, that's probably, it's probably going to be a long video that. I'll just throw what I've got, the footage you've got together and get it online for you. I think it's probably going to be about a 45 minute video. If you don't like 45 minute videos, then just have to wait until I, get, <laughs> until I do some more videos and then uh, I'll try and get back to the 15 minute format because I know not everyone wants to watch for 45 minutes. But uh, it's just a lot quicker and easier for me to edit, edit it in one go.